Okay, so now that we're all here in Unreal Engine, um, we can export out the mesh and texture. You can export the mesh out of Maya, which is fine, but um, you're going to have to export the texture out of Unreal. So to get there, uh, let's say we want to mess with the face. Uh, so after we bring in the mesh, you could also just do it through the blueprint, which is fine too. And grab it here, or find it here. Um, just using the magnifying glass. Uh, same idea if you want to do it here, it just helps you find it. Okay, as we can see, this is what it looks like currently. So, we just gotta right click here, asset, actions, and export. I'll just name it um, export. And keep everything uh, the same. Well, actually, let's not export collision or level of detail. And I don't think there's any vertex color, but we don't need that either. Or this stuff, actually. Okay, just turn everything off. And export. And if we look at the material that's on the main head, highlight that. We can um, find it, material. I'm pretty sure I know which uh, texture it is, but let's double check. Yep, so base color. Yep, it's that first one right here. So we we'll right click that and ask exit actions and export. And it's a TJ. And I'm pretty sure these are actually for the blend shapes. Okay, so anyways, um, that's how you export out of uh, Unreal. If you're doing it out of Maya, you could just uh, select this and export it out. Yep, all the UVs and everything are pretty nice. All the same. Okay, so now we're here in Substance Painter and we're going to import our assets that we exported. So file new, let's select our files, you should find them where you export them. Here's the FPX and let's add the textures. Uh, looks like we'll need some other ones too. Let's go back and find the normal map. Export. Let's put them in the same spot. And we probably also need the roughness map. I'm going to open up uh, Photoshop actually to double check on the roughness map. I remember last time I exported this out, I didn't have. Um, Super good results with uh, having it come out. Yeah, it comes out black for some reason. So 
also it's um, I believe the A channel is supposed to be a ambient occlusion. Green is uh, roughness. I think blue is metallic. All right. Well, this is a little hacky, but I'm gonna use a uh, sniffing tool to just copy this out. It's very important to kind of get like perfect. Sorry, it was uh, freezing up a little bit for me. Looks like it's okay now. It's... Using the arrow key on your keyboard, you can shift this around. smaller Let's just export as a PMG for now. So now I'm Substance Painter, let's add those three materials. Not that one. And we'll work in 2K. Alright, here in Substance Painter, let's just work on the the head um, should be this one. So we can hide the rest. Um, get the eyes for now. So in here, go to the textures set. Scroll down and let's select our normal map. And let's see. Let's go to fill layer. Let's choose the color. Um, let's go to textures. Let's drag this in. Let's grab the normal map. Looks good. And the roughness. Nice. Turn off these guys, we're not really using them. And this could be a pretty good starting point. 